Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today we will discuss about how to apply for ETO COC. After 2017, COC is mandatory for electrotechnical officer on board. The first criteria which is very important for ETO COC is you should have completed at least 8 months of sailing. Some people say that it is 12 months, but these are all assumptions. The actual criteria for ETO COC is 8 months. So now I will tell you in short the procedure how to apply for ETO COC. First, you should have completed 4 months of ETO course from certified DG approved college followed by 8 month followed by at least 8 month of sea service from any type of vessel the vessel can be container tanker lpg lng etc second you should have done all the safety courses about the safety course i will show you which safety course you need to do in this video later along with the approximate price for giving first attempt after eight months of sea sailing it will take at least four months including retail and orals so it will be like this first month all stcw courses second month assessment third month written and oral you can give written and oral in the same month but i would prefer to not to give because orals need good in-depth preparation so fourth month orals so now let's start the procedure applying for ETO COC you need to first search DJ shipping in your web browser it is better if you use mozilla firefox click on the first option and you will reach the DJ shipping website if you are opening this in your mobile please set desktop view after this you need to go to e-governance option here you will again see e-governance as first option. Click on that option. Now you will reach the login page. So here you have to enter your user ID and password. After entering user ID and password, click on login. Now you will see your DG profile. After this, click on the examination option which is fifth option below seafarer after selecting examination you will enter into the new page in this page below the examination there is the second option named as application for eligibility assessment click on that option now press continue now enter mmd year grade and then steam as my mmd is mumbai so i am selecting mumbai make sure that the courses which you are doing from institute it should be dg approved if you have done this course then you can proceed for the next step now press exit don't press confirm please make sure that the courses which you are doing that institute should be DG approved. The course's approximate price is in the description. You can check over there. If you have done this course, then you can proceed to the next step. Now press exit. Don't press confirm. Now you are back on the main page. Now again select application for eligibility assessment and press update profile. You will come to the new page where you will see all the basic details. Fill all the details. Once you have filled all the details, click on next. In this page, you have to fill all your education qualification detail. Start from 10th, after that 12th for diploma, whatever you have done and then degree. After filling all the details, click on next. Now you are on the new page where you will have to fill all the detail about your pre-C institute that is from where you have done your ETO course. After filling all the detail, click on next. In this page, you will have to fill all your modular course details. These details you will find on the certificate which will be given by the institute after completing the particular course. After filling detail of all the courses, click on next. In this page, 
you will have to fill details of your vessel on which you have done sailing. You can put detail of all the ships you have done. I have met the criteria in the first ship itself, that's why I have added detail of only the first ship. After filling the detail, click on next. On this page, no need to fill anything, so click on next. On this page also, no need to fill anything, so click on next. This also next. This also next. This also next. In this page, you have to add your CDC, windows and passport details. After filling all the information, click on next. In this page, you will have to check whether your photo and signature is appearing or not. If not, upload your photo and signature by clicking upload option. Otherwise, go to home by clicking home. Now you are again back to the main page. Click again on application for release and now press continue here you will see the page where you have to select your MMD grade and stream after filling this detail select continue as I have already applied that's why it is showing like this after clicking a pop-up will come which will say these details cannot be changed click on that and your application for assessment will be submitted. After this, you will have to go to the sixth option, which is with the name pay assessment and seat booking fees online. The fees for assessment is 3000. Once you have done, the payment received will come. Take a screenshot or download it. It will be helpful for your assessment. After this procedure, you will have to go to the third option which is with the name Upload Document for Assessment Application. Here you will have to upload all the documents. In my case, it is not showing because my assessment is already done. One more thing, after uploading all the documents, you will have to fill one Google Form whose link is in the description. After uploading documents and filling Google form, you will have to wait at least 20 to 25 days. After this, one email will come to your registered email ID in which details about the assessment date will come. In that email, the list of all the documents will come which you will have to carry. and the address will also come where you have to go for assessment. Once you have done your assessment, wait for two to three days. After two to three days, check your application status. For this, you will have to go on third option, which is with the name upload documents for assessment application. After clicking, you will see current status. It will change from application in process to approved by assessor. Once you see approved, you can give your written exam. For giving written exams, click on seat availability and written oral fees detail. For written and orals exam, you can book only on the first week of month. That is, the seat will open on first and close on seventh. So, it is better to book seat in first 2 to 3 days of the month. You can check the available seat by clicking the option View Seats Available. You can also view fees detail for written and oral exam. The fees for written is 4500 and for orals also 4500. After booking written exam go to pay assessment and seat booking fees online and do payment for written exam remember once you have done payment and the money is deducted but you didn't got received don't do the payment again in this case 
sent email to DG Shipping. After giving the exam, you can check your result on view exam result option. The result will come after 15 to 20 days. Same procedure which you have done for return, you can follow for applying orals also. Thank you for watching the video. If you have any doubt, please comment. I will try to help you in the best way I can.